It's here, folks, the total gym. This is about 87 pounds. I just came today from New Jersey. Bought off eBay. I, this wasn't from a company, so I hope everything's okay. But let's open it up. and It is heavy. Uh, let's open it up and see what, what's, what it has. Okay, so it actually looks like it was taped up. It was sold as new. Um, gives you, there's the CDs, DVDs, owner's manuals, left and right, left and right, um, hand grips, pads, um, straps, and in the center there all the screws, I guess, in the hardware, and then like a, one of the foot rests, here's the unit itself, pretty heavy, so they say watch out for any pinching, and I got the owner's manual open, and I'm going to set this up, so you're going to want to, they say take it from here, to set it up there's the legs down there but just watch this will fall off if you bring it too much this way so you push it all the way towards the the feet and then you lift and there's the two stands on the bottom now using your feet it says open it only about 12 inches Okay, there must be a reason for that, because you don't want it to fall on you. So as you see, I have uh, this pushed all the way over. Watch your feet if this thing tries to fall on you. But the next thing is you have to pull this up. Now to do that, uh, there's a green and a black one. You pull the black one out. Okay. So you pull the black one out. And then pull up the column, they call it, until it snaps in place. Then you have the 1 through 12 levels here. Okay. And you'll see the pin sticking out. So you don't want to use this before that pin is fully engaged. Just take the, uh, once that snaps in place, that pin will pop out right like that. That's on the black one. Now, so I set it on level four, and now I was able to slide the unit back. Because uh, you have to have plenty of room on both sides. Now, let's see what happens when I just push this up. So I imagine there'd be something down here you have to do next, because, like the feet connector thing, um, I'm sure there's, once you get into it, um, There'll be more uh, instructions on how to get those hand uh, cables going. So let's look for the next uh, number on the uh, owner's manual. Also, I was able to get the uh, packaging, you know, those nuts and bolts and from underneath the unit. They'll be all over the place, uh, maybe tied to the railings. So make sure you don't uh, break anything when you take the uh, packaging out. You want to make sure everything is, you see, uh, clipped to the side, or that's how it was anyhow. All the insulation and the hardware was uh, all wrapped, wrapped together. So there is that piece. The foot thing just pops in easy enough. Now let's go up towards the uh, hand cables with the hand grips. A left and a right. I guess they're armrests. So let's let's see if we can hook those up. So the idea here is you have the handle, which is going to face towards the vertical column, and that says left. And then you got the left on this. So the idea here is just find the hardware. And this will go uh, 
uh, just like this. And then we'll find the right screws for that. Um, and then that'll, uh, let's see, they pick either this one or that one, I guess. Um, these are called the ab crunch pads here. Okay, so all the hardware is out. There's this one came uh, separate. Then you have this um, chrome uh, bar here with the bend in it. You have four pins, the tool they gave you, one longer pin, and then uh, I believe that might have something to do with the straps. We'll see. I haven't read that far yet. Um, and you have the eight washers, flat washers, okay, and then you have the, I think they're lock washers, or it's got the cut in it, eight of those as well, and the eight, eight bolts there, okay, let's find out what they're all about, and just so you know which hole to use, uh, they mentioned something about the, uh, uh, your height, so you would use that if you were shorter, or you could use that. Just don't use that uh, last hole there. Now you'll see how this goes. You have the spring washer. That's the one with the cut in it. The flat washer. And the big part of the... Um, big part of the ab crunch board will go towards... Um, the back so the smaller will go towards the column you can see there's the column there All right so let's do that so there's the of course the left and right you got the four uh, bolts on the left and the other four for the right okay so the hitch pin will go in from this outside and pop in like that once again this is the left side and the handle curves in towards the column so we'll take one of these bolts here and we'll put it through this spring washer first then the flat washer and now that's gonna go up to one of the holes into the left side because we're starting with the left so you finger finger tighten these screws and put the tool on they give you just tighten them down four four on each side I'm starting to see how I remember seeing it on TV this much your hands go on the bars you lay face down on that but uh, this is just um, how to set it up or maybe guys you could use your little socket set just don't go too tight on them something says once these holes are stripped you're not going to be able to fix them okay if you have any issues with this just take it off as you can see see what you're doing because uh, if you tighten three of these I just found out uh, you might not be able to get that last one in so even though there's three in they should be loose be put all four in and then these hand grips go just like that. Put one of the pegs in, left and right side. And the pulley bracket with the longer pin goes there on the top. And you have that swing chrome thing there. That goes right in there. Okay, so you can see that pulley comes down okay so we're pretty much all set there and 
that could go up a little higher. Just where you could take them off completely. They say take them off. If you want to, uh, depending on your height or if you're not using them. They're just pins. Just the four pins. Kind of remind, reminds me of the Sobo Flex because uh, that had pins too. But it's definitely good quality. We'll see how long it lasts and maybe make another video when I am used to some of the exercises. Okay, thanks.